<clears throat> hey, all right. Hey, shalom, shalom. All right. Um, it's Priestess I Woman uh, back here with another uh, lesson. This time I'm going to do a um, uh, chalkboard prayer. Um, you know, just to help us out in these times. You know, a lot of things are going on, and um, there's a lot of, um, you know, things that, you know, brothers are trying to do mentally and spiritually, you know. So I want to do something to help us out in the spirit. So first and foremost, I want to give all praises, all glory, and all honors unto Yahweh, Bashem El Shai, Bashem El Kapodash, double honors to the apostles and the elders of the great millstone, and shalom to the hopeful elect out there. Um, so like I said, this is, you know, to help brothers out. Um, and this was uh, inspired by brothers. Those and brothers are just speaking on um, doing things in this time of this lockdown that benefit you mentally, spiritually, uh, physically, you know, things to better yourselves. Because it's one thing that we have uh, in this world of uh, uh, evils that's going right now. Um, during this time of the coronavirus lockdown is uh, is uh, hope. You know, we have hope and we have prayer. And we have the truth, you know, of Yahweh Bashmi was shot. So I'm not going to make this too long. Um, so I just want to go over this prayer here that I have. And this prayer is uh, inspired by uh, Exodus 31 and 3 when the Heavenly Father was setting up um, the tabernacle and the men that were over the tabernacle and the things that they would do they were to uh they were to uh uh um you know build the different things for the tabernacle you know things in the spirit you know and that's what we're trying to do okay but we're also trying to build ourselves mentally and physically and the heavenly father put upon them the holy spirit to do those things okay so this prayer, like I said, is inspired by that particular scripture, Exodus 31 and 3. And like I said, the things that we were speaking about, you know, just amongst the different brothers in the camps. And, um, you know, so I hope that this will edify the elect. But it's a simple prayer. Uh, of course, we're going to start off praying unto uh, uh, Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash. Okay, so we got Yahweh Bahashem. Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakapadash. All right, which is uh, praying all right, to the Heavenly Father and the Son uh, and the uh, Holy Spirit. Okay, and then the Holy Spirit. So it says, Shalakleya, which means uh, send to me. And this is a, a word that brothers uh, should know, but if you don't know, it's, it's sin, which is Shalakleya to me, the Eif. Now, the eighth is knowledge, okay? The Heavenly Father, he put upon those men the knowledge to do what they needed to do, okay? And the same thing for us in these times. So this will be the eighth. Uh, why? Uh, actually, it's supposed to be ka. This is kakum, which is the word for wisdom, but um, it should be kakama. All right, because that's the word they have there in the text. So this will be Wa and Chakama, which Chakama is wisdom. Okay, Wa, all right, Chakama, Wa. So the Lord sent to me knowledge and wisdom and Thabawana. Okay, Thabawana is the Hebrew word for understanding. Okay, Thabawana. All right. So, send us knowledge, wisdom, and understanding uh, in my work, okay? My work, which your work would be like your job, if you're still able to go to a job, or maybe you might be doing something, uh, you know, physically, you might be trying, maybe you got some online things that you got going on to bring in your uh, income for the time being, or maybe you want to work out. You know, um, but you know, whatever is beneficial to you in, in these times, something that you're taking up, 
for yourself is what I'm saying. So the Hebrew word there is um, mala aka ya, which means like my work. Okay, my work, the workmanship, the work that I'm doing. Okay, you know, pertaining to yourself. Wa amaka and your truth, which is the Lord's truth. All right, because we want Yahweh Shai to bless us with knowledge, wisdom, and understanding. And our work, you know, my work, okay, and his truth, so your truth, okay, the work that we have to do for him. And that's ultimately what we want to uh, increase in, okay? So, uh, and I wrote it down here, I hope you can see it. So it says, Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakapadash, send to me knowledge and wisdom and understanding in my work, business, occupation, and your truth. All right, like I said, and this is inspired by Exodus 31 and 3. All right, so I'm going to read it straight through in the Hebrew. Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakaf, Wadash, Shalaklaya, Da'ai, Wa Chakama, Wa Tabawana, Bamala Akaya, Wa Amaka. All right, one more 